Hey guys, it's Jared for 5th Gen Rams. It's been a while, but today we're going to take a look at the 2021 Ram 1500 and some of the new technology they've put in the vehicle. This truck has been graciously loaned to me by our friends at White Rock Dodge. All right guys, so the truck that we have here is a Billet Silver Sport. It does have the Night Edition package, which gives you this awesome blacked out grill along with the Sport Performance hood that looks really aggressive. It does have the 22 inch wheels. Exterior wise, the only thing that gives it away as a 2021 is this truck has the technology package. We're going to take a look at that inside in a few minutes here, but that comes with the LED cargo light and that one's got a camera in it for the new digital rear view mirror. So let's get inside and take a look. All right, so this truck does have some great new features. Some are all new for 2021 and some were actually introduced halfway through the 2020 model year. So let's get into the 2021 stuff and then we'll talk about some of the other comfort and convenience features. So these trucks, of course, all do have the push button start. So I'll go ahead and fire it up there. Up here is the digital rear view mirror. Now that works two ways. It can work as a standard rear view mirror or you can flip it up and it actually uses the camera in the third brake light as your feed for the rear view mirror. You can adjust the brightness and you can adjust the height of the mirror as well. So another all new feature for 2021 is this heads up display here in front of the driver. Now you can set it up through a dedicated menu in your cluster here. You can adjust the height, the brightness, you can adjust what is shown on the heads up display along with the layout. So that's something that's really cool. I'm actually going to go into here, choose content and layout, and I'm gonna choose custom. So when I hit over to custom to edit, you can see this comes up on the 12 inch screen here, which is all new. So you've got a few different settings. This one here is your custom heads up display layout, and you can choose various setups. So with this one, It'll display two things. You can have this, your speed and speed limit. I can switch them. I can put the navigation up here. So if you are navigating, it'll tell you where to turn. You can also choose this one, which is going to show three settings. You can do your speed, what the current speed limit is on the road that you're on, along with your driver assist technologies. So if you're using your lane keep assist or adaptive cruise, it'll actually show you up here on the heads up display, whether you're drifting off to a lane or if the truck sees a vehicle in front of you. Then you've got another setup with four quadrants and another setup with five quadrants. So that's something that's really cool. I like that five quadrant setup. That's how I have this truck set up right now. And another thing that I noticed that's actually pretty cool, obviously they had to do a different dash to make this heads up display work because the unit actually projects from here onto the windshield. But one of the things that they did is they actually use a nicer quality leather on this dash, which I noticed compared to other sport models without the heads up display. So it's just another little uh, added touch that gives you that more expensive feeling. Something else that they've added for 2021 is the off-road pages here in the cluster. So it'll show you whether your rear locker is locked or unlocked, whether you're in four wheel drive or two wheel drive, It'll show you your steering angle on the right there, and then you can tab over. Now, I'm going a little too fast for this, so I'm gonna slow down here, because it only works up to 40 kilometers an hour because it's set up for off-road. But see there, it'll show you your pitch and roll too. Just another cool little thing they brought over from Jeep. Okay guys, and this Sport actually has some cool features that they added halfway through the 2020 model year to the Sports as well. So you can now get a comfort and convenience group, and that includes the wireless charger, which previously wasn't available on the Sport, along with the heated rear seats, and the memory settings for the driver's seat. So you can actually have two settings, one for you and one for a second driver. The mirrors, radio presets, and seat will all go to where you saved it for yourself as a driver. But that's gonna do it for our quick first look at the 2021 Ram 1500. I hope you guys learned a bit about some new features. 